What's up everyone, it's Afido from Self Taught Hustle. And today I wanted to get you guys to think about a question that is very important for anybody who falls within these two camps, which is somebody who is currently learning to code or somebody who is thinking about learning to code. And one of the things that I recommend you all focus on is determining what your why is. And what I mean by that is, why do you wanna learn to code? Or why are you learning to code? And depending on what your answer is, will really give you a measure of how likely you are to stick out the path that it is to become a professional software engineer. I've made a video before about how there is no easy button when it comes to learning to code. You will spend long nights by yourself, um, you know, looking at code, uh, not understanding most of it. Um, you kind of bashing your head along, kind of bashing your head uh, amongst your monitor or computer. Um, you're going to spend a lot of your time confused. You're going to be have to, you know, sacrifice a lot of time that you would be spending with your with your friends friends or your loved ones, um, you're going to have to uh, be put in really uncomfortable positions in interviews. You're going to have to do a plethora of interviews. You're going to hand, have to handle tons of rejection. Um, you're going to have to consistently battle yourself to be able to get the successes and the results that you want. Um, you're going to have to consistently uh, be okay with not knowing um, and, 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 and more and more and, 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 and your life's not going to stop, right? So problems that come with just being alive, external problems, um, those aren't going to stop. So if you don't have a good why as to why you're doing this, uh, this journey, um, I, it's not, you're, you're likely not going to stick it out. Right. And I don't mean that to be cruel, but more so just to draw a line of really, really making sure that your head is in the right spot or your head is in the right place when you go in this journey, because as I've said many times before, I, I, I get tired of seeing guys, you know, drop out and, um, you know, maybe it's just something that they pick up for a couple months, but they don't last. They don't last. And I think a, a, another reason why that is the case is, is because they, they haven't defined their why. You know, why, why is it that they really want this? Why is it that they're really willing to make those sacrifices? And I think uh, if, if that could be, if, if, that's a, if there's a good enough answer there that can concretely, you know, help you as the, as the coder uh, be able to withstand and bear um, some of the toughest times in this journey, especially in particular as a, as a self-taught developer, um, then, then, then the success is yours then the success is yours and it's just a matter of time before you get it. But if not, then um, you're, you're, you're more likely to falter where as to if you had a good, a good why uh, you could continue, you know, or you could withstand that. Um, so yeah, so that, that's all I wanted to say today. Just uh, some things for you guys to think about. Uh, as always, uh, comments on the video, share the video, like the video, and I really appreciate you guys and I will see you next time.